tra train station in Barrington looks like it always does, but over the weekend it was packed with people definitely ready for Christmas. <laughs> Families jam the platform, cheering on children aboard a decked out Metro train. More than 200 gathered at the Barrington stop to support Operation North Pole. The nonprofit gives families of children battling serious and terminal illnesses a day to forget their troubles. The ride starts in Crystal Lake, then rolls through several towns before reaching Rosemont. And as CBS 2's Jim Williams reports, then families enter a magical winter wonderland. Santa escorts 75 families into the Stevens Convention Center. To their surprise, they enter a gauntlet of honor ceremony where emergency responders from various departments are on one knee, clapping and giving high fives. And then they enter the fantasy land. We didn't know what to expect, but this is just outstanding. Two, one. The staff and volunteers at Operation North Pole have everything covered. From dancing to Santa Claus, happy to take pictures and requests. Are you going to tell Santa what you'd like to see? There's even a place to write letters to old St. Nick. How about a D? Oh, she's calling you. Oh, she's the Pick it up, hurry up. And a phone booth to call an elf. Here she is on the other line. We're having fun at the North Pole. And of course, there's plenty of food and tons and tons of candy. It's been a Christmas fantasy. For the Powell family, they call their son Daniel a modern miracle. He's now thriving after having a successful bone marrow transplant. It's been a long journey and it's really nice to just see kids be able to enjoy this type of moment. For others, it's a day off from worrying. You forget about the whole situation, you forget about the cancer, it, you just, you know that there's goodness in the world. I love, like, the place for the girls and writing this, uh, letters for Santa, it's really fun. Completely overwhelmingly surprised, like the fact that there are so many volunteers and people that give of their time and their talents, I don't have words. As the families leave, there's one last surprise. The kids' wish list from Santa pretty much fulfilled, wrapped and ready to go under the tree for Christmas morning. To learn more about helping, head to OperationNorthPole.org and you can see why she is without words because that's just incredible. Yeah, awesome they didn't just story. give toys. They went all out mm -hmm. for the kids. I 